Hi everyone, the Global Surveyor. I'm out here in Blacktown today. And you can see I've got the like it's here, 16. So we're looking at the check and adjust program here. And you can see the results here. Uh, one second, zero, 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 one second, etc. And I've just calibrated the like it's here, 16. And to do that, what are we gonna do? Well, firstly, we're going to have a tripod about 100 metres away down at the end of the street there. So I can adjust the ATR, automatic target recognition, and the horizontal uh, collimation on this tier 16. And then we need to find something tall like this building, which I've used a rivet towards the top of the building so I can adjust the vertical collimation. And it's recommended that you do this check and adjust at least every three months or if you're putting your field light hub station in the back of your vehicle and going for a long trip or on a bumpy road or you're undertaking a precise survey, control survey, boundary marking subdivision or something like that, it's always worth running the check and adjust feature and also taking it to a local baseline just to verify the distances. So that's what I've been up to today. And uh, here in Blacktown, there's a few new works happening. But this is quite a tall building. It's very hard to find a building that you can measure from here. 100 metres along the ground and something about 100 metres away there. And uh, for, for the time being, until these other buildings get built, that's what I'll be doing. So there you go. Check and adjust. If you're a surveyor, just make sure that you do this on a regular basis. And if you find that the values are grossly wrong, as you can see here, they're very, very good then it's time to take it to your local like at top con trimble take it to your local instrument manufacturer and get them to do a service thanks so much for watching everyone see you later